What's up guys, John Smith on YouTube, how y'all doing? You guys are probably wondering, why haven't you made a video in like a month, bro? Like, what are you doing? Honestly, I don't really have a reason. I just, just stopped making videos, you know? I just didn't feel like making a video anymore. And like I told you, I don't want to, I don't want to force myself to do something when I know it's gonna come across. I didn't want you guys to get crappy videos because I'm trying to force some creativity, trying to force a persona that's not really me, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, this is Dread Update number 10. I know I did one in the prison video, but I felt like that was kind of cheap. Um, I have a ton of clips of my hair like in different settings, like when it's wet or out in the sunset or, you know, against the sky. I, I've just been taking videos. I haven't been posting videos, but I've been filming a lot of stuff, making a lot of beats, doing a lot of music. I do other stuff, you know what I mean? Nothing has really changed with my dreads. They have gained a lot of length, though, since the last dread update. You can see that this, just by pulling it down on it, is down to my neck now. Um, this kind of has the same thing. They're very long. I didn't go out, so I haven't taken a shower, so my hair is still kind of dry from this morning, and it's like bunched up, so that's why this looks like it's really far up. I actually gotta flip this and look at myself. Um, that's why this looks like it's very far up, um, if you can see that. But yeah, to all the people who have been commenting, showing me that you're still looking out for me, you know, you understand that I haven't left you forever, you just wanna know where I'm at. Thank you, I appreciate each and every one of you guys that have subscribed or liked or done any of that for a video. Hey guys, it's a focus issue, honestly, because I do videos, I make music, I wanna do clothing, I wanna do so much stuff, and you kinda get, you know, backtracked on one of those three things. Or if I'm doing music, like I've been making a ton of music lately, I don't really have the time to do videos or focus on the clothes as much as if I wasn't doing music at all, if you understand. So that's what's been going on with me. But people ask me if I dye my hair, no, again, it's just the sun. Um, but what I've been noticing is I have a ton of hair and I wear it back like this a lot now because of my job. So I have a ton of hair ties and just stuff to hold it. Um, People ask me how do I feel about the ponytail look. I actually like it. No, it's not. It's not anything bad. Girls like the ponytail look, so I'm not very. I'm not against it. You know. Um, I f's with it, but this is what it looks like in a ponytail. And this is a loose ponytail. I don't really do tight ponytails. I have um, hair ties that are about like this big, and the ponytail is just. It hurts so much. Like I told you, it pulls back your hairline. You could just feel that tension but this is kind of what the ponytail looks like or how i go to work um hopefully you can see this with this dark background yeah that's how the ponytail looks um it's smooth like it doesn't look i don't look too weird with my hair up um as long as i keep this brushed and you know lined up then i think it, it looks fine but <clears throat> i'm gonna show i'm gonna play a beat that i've made and i'm gonna show a bunch of clips to it and then that's gonna be a little cinematic end for this and then we're gonna come back and we're gonna do the q a Q&A time. Hopefully the audio is better. I got a new mic a while ago that I haven't even had the time to test out yet officially on YouTube. So tell me if the audio quality sounds any different. First question, Jordan Hughes. My man, where'd you go? Hopefully that was dramatic enough. Um, You know, I just got backtracked. You know what I mean? I can't. I just fell off. That's all I can really say. Rapid overkill. John Smith, I got my hair twisted. If I just leave it alone for at least six months, will it still freeform? Yes, because you got it twisted. If you just don't touch it for six months, it's just gonna get more and more tangled, tangled, tangled till it's dreaded up. Then it will mature and grow on like that. D Thompson, do you moisturize your hair with any type of oil or just leave it dry? I don't really moisturize it. I know when I was twisting and my hair would itch, I would put olive oil on my scalp to kind of ease that, but I don't really do anything now. Um, I should put more oil in my hair because sometimes I do feel like it might be a little dry, but I just never get around to it. And yeah. Simeon Real asks, so it's still possible to get dreaded if your whole head had been texturized before? Because every time my hair gets wet, 
it loosens up and get curly. I don't know why I can't speak today, but to answer your question, it is possible, but it might take a little bit more maintenance in the startup to get it going. In your case, if your hair gets curly every time it gets wet, I'll recommend twisting it up, you know, with some gel or something and then leaving that or even crochet hooking or back combing, whatever works for your hair texture to get it into that beginning stage. And then from there you can freeform. I would say try it out, tell me what you think, and then we can go on from there. And then semi freeforming is better. That's one of you guys Snapchat at me. Snapchat is John Smith, snap code right here. Go follow me on there and then we can, you know, talk about stuff. I'll answer your questions. Trey Williams asks, so you think starting dreads off freeform would look better? I mean, do you think they'll sort of end up looking like yours a little? Or do you think getting them twisted and then semi freeforming is better? It's completely a matter of opinion. I didn't start off freeformed. I started off twisted, then I took those out, and then I started slowly getting into semi freeforming and then went the freeform route because I don't really touch my hair as much as I used to. I don't I can't pick out, you know, a couple of people off the top of my head that I know that have done each method and then say pick I don't I don't know so you would have to do some research look at what you think would be better for you and then go ahead with that but I recommend getting dreads in general dreads are a really good growing process and I think they're very beneficial to anyone who tries them so do that thank you Wiwini Morgan is it possible to start freeform dreads if your hair already has some length if it's not long but it's not short either my hair is quite thick and tends to curl naturally um, yeah, you can start off with a little bit of length. I did that and my hair seems to have dreaded up fine and come out good. Everybody likes it. So yeah, you know, go for it. What's, what's not, what's stopping you from dreading your hair at any length? Like there's nothing stopping you. So you can go for it. Yeah. Mr. Mystery E, where you been at? We've been missing your videos. I know. So I'm trying to get back on my game. I, I've noticed I've been slacking. I'm sorry. You know, it's just life. Life happens. If you don't stop and look around for a second, you might miss it. Ferris Bueller. SXXXY asks, how long have you been growing? I want to say roughly two years. Like, I want to say rough, rough. Maybe I'm a month or a couple of weeks off, but two years exactly. Roughly, exactly. Uh, yeah. Kimboli Sinyangui asks, do you have to pick your hair out every morning? Because my hair is a mess when I wake up. You don't have to pick your hair out. Don't. Don't even mention pick around freeform. There's no pick in anything. Normally if I wake up and my hair's a little, you know, I've done this before. If I wake up and my hair's a little crazy, this is normally how it is in the morning because I wear it in a ponytail the day before. But you know, you just, you just shake it out. If you think it's too up, you know, too pushed up, you just pull it down and you're good. You're ready to walk out the door. It's freeform. You don't have to do as much maintenance as a lot of you guys are asking questions about. Like, you know, just let it form. It's free. It's on its own so hopefully you guys enjoyed that dread update tell me what you think in the comments anything you're feeling put it in the comments and i'll talk to you guys um really appreciate you guys even clicking on this to watch it if you liked it please leave a like comment uh follow me on twitter hvppytree and instagram hvppytree i posted a new song on soundcloud called grow i know that i've been into this grow thing for a while but that's kind of what my concept is right now um next song should be even better than this new one but i produced this new one and it's all me. Everything from this song is me. So go check that out. Tell me if you like it. I'll put it right here. Um, other than that, I'll see you guys next time. I don't know when next time is going to be. But until then, please keep growing for me. Keep growing for yourself. And yeah, peace. Peace.